Hello, hello, it's Tracy from Gift Basket Appeal and Mindless Crafting, and happy Saturday to everybody. Bill is here in the room with me. He's going to be looking at your comments and reading them uh, so we can hear what y'all are saying. So welcome to my craft room on a Saturday. It's a bright, sunny day, um, and What's we're gonna we're gonna just have fun. You bright it up though, huh? There you go. It's a little overcast, but to me, it's bright and sunny out. So welcome to our craft room. We're gonna be doing something. I've been, I'm I'm creating something that was has been in my head for a while, and I need to get it out. So what better way to get it out than live, right? <laughs> exactly. So come on into the craft room. Um, I'm so glad that y'all are here, and I hope you're having a wonderful Saturday. So these envelopes, let me show you what I have. This is going to make a really good teacher gift. Um, I got these envelopes, and they've been in my stash. How many of y'all buy envelopes, and they're just there? These are like some red envelopes. They've been in my stash for like... Well, it seems like forever, you know? And these I got at Ollie's. Ollie's, if you have an Ollie's near you, they have some great envelopes. And so for 59 cents, yes, y'all, look at that, 59 cents. And what they call them is, it's 10 envelopes for 59, 59 cents, and they're policy size envelopes. So let's go ahead and open these up and, and get some crafting envelopes you want. You see it's got a little bit of damage to it, but that's all right. We can always cover it up, can't we? So I'm going to make a cute little teacher gift I was thinking about making. And I had not tried it with these. And now that I opened them up, they're really very light. So we'll see what we can do with these. So y'all have seen me do this before. But if I, anyone's buffering, just refresh your screen. I, I don't think I've done this live. Let's see, so I'm going to do maybe three envelopes. I could do two. Maybe three. It's a little bit more decorating. All right. Let's put these aside. So you, it does does not have to cost a lot to make a teacher gift. And if you're not comfortable using this size paper, you can use a different size. So y'all excuse me while I mindlessly craft on this Saturday afternoon here. Just showing y'all what I would do in my craft room if y'all were sitting right next to me. So let's see. Okay, so we got that. I got some stickers I'm going to put in there because teachers love stickers. So I think that would be a nice gift idea to put slide inside the envelopes. And also, here's some more stickers. Y'all, they had EK Success stickers at Dollar Tree. Can you believe that? EK Success, y'all, at Dollar Tree. I don't know if y'all have seen these before, but teachers like stars and stuff like that. They, they, they like to plan, so you can put it, they can use these in their so we'll put those aside for now and then I've got the paper you remember this I made in a video for those of did y'all those of y'all that did not see this um, this was one of the things I made and I'm gonna decorate I'm gonna decorate the cover of this with that so we'll put that aside and we got some stickers. this came from the back to school paper um, from Laurie Whitlock this is the e Echo Park paper and um, that's that back to school paper. And I thought it would be so nice to show y'all another idea using that paper. So let me get adjusted here because I have some wires hanging down here that there shouldn't be. So, so this is the, yeah, we actually carry this paper in the store too. And there's some left. So you know, I may want to get that. So, and it's got stickers in it. Look at this. Got stickers in there bunch of stuff. So it's one of those paper kits. Look how pretty the patterns are on this. Ooh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have so much fun decorating this. Look at this. 
smart as a whip, sharp as a tack. Awesome. Let's see what's on the other side of that paper. Just giving y'all a little bit to see. Look how cute that lined paper. Teachers can take notes, right? Write little notes in there. So this is going to be fun. So, oh, look at that. The notebook. <laughs> ah. Yes, Diane Solomon, can you see it? Are the wheels turning, y'all, for the possibilities? This is going to be oh, so much fun. The possibilities are going to be endless. I think I'm going to, I like this right here. I might use this on, I'm not sure yet. Y'all hold tight, okay? We'll see. <clears throat> this might be nice on the cover, too. So the store says if she was a teacher, she would love that bag. Would you? That actually is a good pack. It really is. For not only a teacher, but for um those of you that, you know, um want to create gifts for teachers. So I'm hoping that I can help y'all with this, you know, because I think teachers need that motivation throughout the year. Or anyone that, that deals with kids, uh, homeschooled, uh Oh yes, educators. it doesn't yeah. Teachers go beyond just the classroom, you know? Yeah. Even people who work at the YMCA, I remember uh, we used to take our parents to the YMCA afterwards, and they would do a lot of after-school projects and all kind of things. And for all intents and purposes, they were teachers, just not officially, but they still operated in that capacity. They would probably love to get a card like this. Look, now, this is how I would normally do this, right? So I'm going to do it exactly how I would do it. <laughs> if y'all wasn't watching, if y'all weren't watching, Krista says she loves the sound of that paper. Sounds like great quality. And that's when you're a real crafter. Yeah, you don't even have to see. You can just listen it really, to the paper. It really is. Krista, you're at another level. Okay. This is nine and three eighths by four and one eighth. But I am not measuring that, that on my board. Like nine and one eighths by four. <laughs> I'm going to just go ahead and do this. And cut some of these out. I don't want to take a whole lot of time cutting these. Susan Stewart says, if you're real crap, you should, you should be able to smell it. There you go. Smell the paper. Oh, it smells like quality. It smells like quality paper. And my lines might not be straight on these, y'all. It's just, I'm just going to do, do what makes me feel good right now, okay? And cutting right now without, <laughs> without measuring feels really good. So I want y'all to follow along with me on this journey in my craft room. I love that y'all are here with me. As real horse brother says, yes, I'm so glad you're doing this project live. I've made a few of these, but I have been unsure about what to put inside of them. Oh, we're going to show you. Teachers love gift cards. Um, listen. Teachers use their own money to buy their supplies. Let's not, and, and librarians too. I've used a ton of money just to pull off certain craft things with the kids because it just wasn't in the budget. And I really wanted to have the kids to have a good time. So, you know, unfortunately, um, it shouldn't be that way. But teachers spend a whole lot of money and librarians too. A lot of teachers, the majority of them spend their own money. Buy their own. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, man. <laughs> you know I'm always late to the party. Yeah, I'm like, huh? <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh yes, the stickers. I gotta show y'all. Maxine Kane says she loves the letter paper. She wishes that they had that kind of paper pad in the University of Kentucky. Uh oh. Or the U UK for those. That oh, the UK. Y'all <laughs> yeah. got your own thing going on here. It's me and Maxine. We have our thing. thing. Y'all bear with me while I do my little cuttings. And I could probably do a bunch of these together, but I'm just going to play it safe for now. Playing it safe. <laughs> so y'all should be out shopping. Y'all over here watching us live. We went to the, we had a busy morning. You know what? Chris is right. That, 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 that's like the composition book look paper. That's, I, that's what I was saying. I'm late again. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like me and Krista both are late. Where y'all at? Okay. Krista, we're late. Where y'all at? <laughs> like, huh? <laughs> oh, boy. My darling hubby. Look at the cards. Uh, I love those. I'm going to cut some of those up and put them in there, too. 
Look at this. This is so cute. Look at the calculator. That is cute. You Isn't can use that, that. Yeah, you can use all kinds of stuff. The stickers, y'all. I'm going to have so much fun with this. I like this. What we learn becomes who we are. Ooh, look at that. That's Bill's favorite. Bill's favorite. Look at this. All of this gorgeous stickers, y'all. Isn't this awesome? Yes, this is so... I lo I'm loving this, okay? This is going to be a fun project. At least it is in my he head. <laughs> I'm making it fun. I got to get some of this. And I'm not afraid to cut up my papers, y'all. It took me a while to get past that. Like, oh, this is too pretty to cut up. But you just got to. Y'all are both late to the party, huh? <laughs> Krista, that's all right. At least you're here. That's what matters. You're here. I love doing projects like these. Has anyone ever done um, these envelopes before? I'm just asking the question. Yeah, Margie, you know what? When the papers come like this in that 12 by 12 pack, especially the Echo Park, you can't go wrong because they normally put the stickers in there too. Um, they put like the strips like this right here. See this ruler? I can cut the strips down and use those to decorate. So it's almost like everything is figured out for you. You just have to take it and run with it. So let's see how many of these we have to cover our book. Lady Harris says, if I could go shopping, I'd be shopping on mine as crap and catching up on my stamps. There you go. <laughs> <sighs> that green looks cute. What do y'all think about this, the green? I think the green would look nice too. So I just measured once and I'm just cutting this out, y'all. It's okay. I'm just not going to think about it. I'm just going to do it. Mimi B says she stops shops during the week when the store is not as crowded, either early or late in the day. Well, if y'all didn't tune in this morning, we were live again. Might have been afternoon, right, man? It was before this. Yeah. <laughs> Hope so. Just barely. Yeah, we actually were out and about this morning. And I just had to go to Dollar Tree to see if they had the Christmas stuff out. And, of course, they did. Denise Glisson is watching while she's having her car wash. Oh, nice. Hi, Sylvia Delgado. She's from Ecuador. Hey, Sylvia. And whatever you have left over can be turned into a matching card for the teacher. You got a little gift to put in there, and then you got a nice little card you can make. You can make some mini cards using this paper also. So don't go having that paper sitting up on your shelf. I know, y'all. I see you. I see you. Sling, is that a Sling Griffin? This is her first time being live. Refresh your page if you if you uh if you're buffer. buffering, yep. Well, welcome, A Sling. I'm not even sure if I, I like pronounced that, that right. It's, it's a beautiful name. Okay, so let's go ahead and get some of these together here. Okay, so now when you're gluing these together, you want to leave just a little bit of leeway right here so that when you're bending it, when you're bending it in, you don't have it like right on the crease, just a little bit, because you're going to be putting things in here. So you want to, because it's going to be a little bit bulky, you just want to leave a little bit of space there. So let me go ahead and do that now. And I'm using my art glitter glue. Hopefully I have some left. I actually have some on order right now because... Um, Aisling said you said her name right. No one ever says it right. Oh, okay. It's the first for us, okay? I have mutilated many names. Yes, he has. It's the first, yeah. <laughs> Deborah Otterich says, from England says she's making knitted poppies while watching. Oh, nice. Look at y'all crafting on a Saturday, doing what you love. Louise Castia says, I never made one, so I'm going to try to do it, and I will send it to you to show you how I did. Oh, nice. Oh, that's so nice. That is so sweet. We love we're looking to show. To it. Yes, we love when y'all are inspired. So you see how that closes? Okay. And then we're going to add a third one. I was going to do two, but you know what? Hey, hey might as well do three. Robert Renner says, oh, shoot, I forgot my recipe. You have time. 
That's the Donna Saturday. Don't worry, you'll get it in there. Oh, yes, you have time. We're going to do until the end of September. So y'all have time to um, to get it in. Uh, Donna's going to put the... Um, is Don Donna's here, right? Yeah. Donna, if you can actually put the email address that they can send their recipes to, that would be awesome. So we're still doing the recipe swap. And then Donna is going to compile those and and send them out to y'all through email. And Donna just put the recipe up. mcrecipeswap at gmail.com. Thank you. So, Thank you, yeah, Donna. so this is going to be fun. We thought it would be nice for everyone to send in their recipe. Bill, can you pass me my bone folder? There it is. The throwing knife thing that you could always call Where? it. The throwing knife. The gray thing. Stick it on there. Yeah. Oh, I was looking for the brown one. <laughs> this thing right here. You know what? I want to be with Patricia McNeil. She says, watching you from a beautiful condo at Myrtle Beach. Oh, nice. Patricia. That's Go, me. Patricia. Patricia. Hi, Kathleen German. Hey, Kathleen. 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 We're glad you're healing up, you're girl. Kidding. Man. We're For glad you're you healing up. A part of the gift basket crafters group. Uh, well, me and Kathleen are friends, so she didn't post it in the group. Okay, but, yeah. yeah. So, but I saw oh, it, and she's, you know, she needs some healing she prayer. Said a scratch. That's not a scratch. That is not a scratch. That thing is like oh, a. Look, I got. I'm glow, oh, look at that. You were there with a lion or something, okay? Wood grain. And I'm not matching. Notice, y'all. I'm not matching all of these up together. I'm just gonna just do it and glue it. Sounds like a rhyme, right? Do it and glue it. Aisling says she loves the black pattern with the letters. Isn't that the key? Everyone cutest? likes that pattern with the letters. Now y'all make me want to switch up a little bit. It makes bit. you think of school. Yes, it does. Uh, you ever go to the blackboard because, okay, if your screens glitch, just refresh them. You ever do something when you're in elementary school and you found yourself at the board writing, I will be quiet, I will not talk. Mm, I will sit no. down. I will be quiet something. No. Nope. <laughs> I, I lived at the board, okay? I tell you what, I stopped living at the board, though. One time I did something. And the teacher put me behind the door. I was in the sixth grade. Mm. And I didn't care. It, was, I, it, it didn't bother me at all until I looked down the hall and saw my mother come walking down, was walking down the hallway. Mm. My heart almost dropped out of my body because my mother did not play. And <laughs> what I did, I, I quickly went across the hall because the bathroom was right across. And... Uh, I tried to play it off, but eventually a student came in the in the, in the bathroom and said, uh, "Billy, your uh, mom's out your there." Your mom says, "Come to the classroom, mm. please." My mother paddled me in front of the entire class. Oh, needless to say, I never had any problems whatsoever. Ever again, huh? Ever. <laughs> oh my goodness. Ever. Molly, watch. You know what? I keep having to refresh also, and I'm over here. I don't know what it is today. Uh-oh. Donna Sally says, I'm running behind time here. It just dawned on me that you're making an envelope flip book card. That's what I'm doing. Well, it didn't dawn on me yet, Donna, so you're still ahead yeah, of Bill me. Yeah, Bill didn't know, and he was like... I just saw some red paper with glue and said, oh, look, she's doing glue with some paper. Mm. That's as far as I had gotten. Let's see, I'm trying not to think about this, y'all. I just want to start just gluing stuff down. Ooh, I got to go this way. Got to have the letters Brenda, in there. Brenda Andrew Zeski said, I had to refresh and almost lost y'all. Don't lose us. Me and Broad, I keep refreshing too. Don't you dare lose us. Oh, Nadine asked a question. Let me go find it, Nadine. If it happens to go off, if if it happens to um go off, we'll come right back on. We're Nadine, not going to give up. Nadine Harris says, is this paper in the store? This paper, yes, is in the store. It's um, Back to School by Lori Whitlock, and it's a 12 by 12 paper kit. Yes. And y'all hear that? Look, that's some sturdy cardstock right there. That's some sturdy stuff the right there. It? Back to School. 
Okay. By Lori Whitlock. This is an Echo Park paper. So I'm going to find it. And it's a 12 by 12. All right. Because my thing is you can make, I mean, people may all, you may also have, um, you know, family members that are teachers and they just need that extra thing. You can give them a gift card. Cause they do use their own money. I mean, it's just well, the, okay. Now the link I put in there just now will take you directly to that. If you're looking for that particular paper. Yeah. I am in love with this paper right here. I am loving this paper. G Dixon must have a supercomputer. She says she's having no problems on her end. Okay. And I'm just smoothing this down with my bone folder, here, which Bill calls the throwing knife. <laughs> Diane said she had to refresh three look times. Look at that already, y'all. Look at look at this already. It's coming together. Don't think about it. Just do it. Now let's see if I have my punch here. Mm -hmm. Let's see. We're just going for it, y'all. We're just yeah. going for it. I almost had to refresh and then I came out of it. So imagine you can put a bunch of stuff here, here, here. I mean, just everywhere on this. Just make sure you don't do like I did and glue like the whole Everything thing down. Everything is kind of cool. And I like this right here. This little dip allows me to do something else um, with Tracy, that. Nadine Harris says she has six teachers in the family. And my great-grandson just started pre-cray. 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 I hope he didn't start that. Pre-K. Pre-cray. <laughs> He's in pre cray that's, that's, pre that's pre advanced pre study. <laughs> pre kindergarten huh? <laughs> so anyway, those would be nice gifts. That's what I was trying Man, to get to. So funny. Pre cray Hope we didn't start that. <laughs> I'll move this out to here. I'm loving this. Look at this ruler, y'all. Mayor Brock says now six envelopes glued together with ribbon on one end makes a great storage to hang. Oh. I hadn't even thought of that. Mayor Look Brock at that. Going in. Right, Mary Brock. Punch holes here. Hang Mary something in there. Hang something in there. Hang something in there. That's a great idea. Y'all get this? This way. Oh my goodness. Y'all need to stop the ideas y'all have. Mary did some stuff on that one. Mary Brock, look at you. You about to inspire a whole bunch of people. This is why I like the lives. I love doing lives because live, you can, anything can happen, first of all. <laughs> Marjorie says her niece is a teacher. Yes. She could use a little extra, some stickers or whatever, you know. You know what, Kathy? And you don't have to wait till teacher appreciation, which is at the end of the year. You can keep motivating teachers throughout the year. Kathy German has a great observation. She says it's possible to go to too many people on the internet because of Saturday. You know, sometimes when it overflows the internet. That's possible, too. Yeah. That's possible. I don't, you know, I'm not a tech kind of person. Somewhat. <laughs> I'm going to put this right here. So if you wanted to write a message to the teacher or stamp something on there for the teacher, you could. So Carrie Woods is a teacher. Uh-oh. She says right now that she's calculating data from assessments they did this week at school to determine the reading levels. Of the students. Mm. Well, we appreciate all your hard work. Exactly. Thank you so much. You really do. I've always said teachers are probably the most underappreciated group in America, maybe. Underpaid. You know? Underpaid. Yeah. What they do, what they bring to the table. They're literally out preparing Oops. the next generation. Wow, I could have just done that in one shot, huh? This will make it easier when you're trying to kind of grab some of the stuff out of there. <laughs> oh. oh, I like this right here too. Okay, too late. Made in here, so that's pre K free. Pre -K. What's, what's that? Pre K on steroids? Or is that three <laughs> pre K? Pre K. I was sad. Just I can't even say that. On. He had too much coffee, y'all. <laughs> well, y'all know what I mean. That's pre K on uh, pre K. You, you do it three <laughs> times in a row. This, oh, Bill, like, no, cut up this that. paper right here. Good, thank goodness I didn't see it. See, this will stop you from cutting your paper when you look at other yeah. papers. This will stop you right here. 
My art gritter grew is messing up. <laughs> art gritter grew. Art gritter grew. Bill, you know we rename stuff all the time. Apparently. My art gritter grew. <laughs> Uh, Y'all know what I mean. Y'all know what I mean. Everyone knows except Maxine Cave. Maxine Cave is not to know. I'm speaking in the Maxine Cave accent. That does not sound like Maxine Cave at all. Okay? Her did sound kind of cool, didn't it? Her, I, she didn't have an accent, babe. She had an accent. I heard it. It was so cool and smooth. Bill, you used up all my art glitter I grit her. Art, you can't even the, say it. The now. other night when you were crafting, see, I didn't want this to happen, y'all. What so happened? This is what happened, but that's okay. No, it's all right. It's all right. Everything's all right. I didn't want that to, um, but it's okay. I didn't want that to glue down. Susan Stewart, so curious. It's your, not okay. Your homework sounds way too hard. Yeah, Susan, Susan, I keep it simple. We just look at the kids and say, Can you read? Can you read? If you can read, stand on this side. If you can't, get on that side. Look, this we start from there. This right here is going to be glued down, y'all, because I wasn't paying attention. It's talking gonna, about art gritter groove. It's going to be glued down. It's going to be saying? glued down. Look, because I wasn't paying attention to what I was doing, so that's okay. <laughs> on this side, you're going to go like this, right around the edge there. We're going to leave this for teacher notes. Because we don't want to glue the pocket down, we want to be able to slide something in. So you only want to glue around here. Oh, you get it? In a mess here, real quickly, Sir Tracy, we have a few people that just came in. Just briefly tell them what you're making again. I am making an envelope flip book for the teacher, and it's going to have pockets in it so that you can slide little stickers in there for the teacher. You know, you can make it nice and big. Um, I mean, or bulky, I should say. Let's make sure it can close. And so this will make, this is a great gift idea for a teacher as well. So we want to make sure that that can kind of close a little bit. Might put a little bit of a spine on there. We don't know. This one I glued shut. Don't do that, y'all. <laughs> don't do that. So this one is open, right? So you just want to glue here, like around here. Don't glue this part here like I just did. <laughs> and we're using the Back to School Paper Pack by Lori Whitlock, which is in our store. And we're going to use this for the cover. This is going to be fun covering it with this. This, is, our, Cave this is our back to this is our teacher appreciation stamp set, which is also in the store right here. Tracy. Maxine says she needs to get her some art gritter grew. Go get some gar <laughs> some gart. Gar some gart. <laughs> oh my god. Oh boy, it's what's getting going worse on? as the thing goes on. <laughs> Y'all are funny. Now, if you want, you can also use um your uh if y'all use like the crafters um tape. <laughs> The Ad Tech Crafters tape, you can use this too, and you can get the same effect. Oh man, I got it now. I understand what pre K, <laughs> pre K free is. Pre, pre, <laughs> pre K free. Pre K free. No, I think oh, at this level, I'm gonna have to go to pre K myself if I can't if I keep messing up this word. I don't know. Them pre K. Nadine Harris, <laughs> Nadine Harris says what it is. He's three years old and he's in pre kindergarten level. He is. Oh, wow. Smarty. Okay. He's going to be messing up the curve for years. They're going to, the rest of the kids going to throw him out the classroom. Get out. <laughs> messing up the curve. Go ahead and mess up that curve. Be you. You see how that came out? Something. Oh, ooh, Mary Brown says, on the one you made a mistake and glued down and a post it note. Had for the teacher. Ooh. Ooh. Man, oh, you know stuff, what? I have my post it notes, Bill. Where's that? Um, Man, we got to do this. Got it. Just got it, actually. I had some post it notes to add in there. This is going to be pretty bulky, y'all. Hi, Kathy. Kathy Champion just made it. Oh, uh, let's see. Dion Solomon, Diane, here's a good question. She says, Has anyone tried the reptile glue? 
Diane, I, me, I saw the reptile group, and I, I think I may order it just to see. In all honesty. I didn't understand that. <laughs> I didn't ask you nothing. Phone My phone is trying to talk to me. <laughs> I didn't ask you. He just thing. woke up all of a sudden. I'm like, what on earth? Bill, wait a minute. How did these get in my bag? How did what? <laughs> How did those get in the bag, Bill? <laughs> you found my stuff. You little bag. <laughs> really? Bill, that's not supposed to be in there. Like, how did those jump off the shelf? Hmm. Y'all, how did those jump off the shelf? Sorry, y'all, I had to go get something. Robin Reninger says, where did you get the red envelopes? These were at um, Ollie's. Eight, uh, 50, 59 cents at Ollie's. Yeah, nice quality. Thick kind of nice quality texture. Oh, boy, this is going to be really bulky, huh? Y'all saying put post-it notes in there. But Bill, look at this. Yeah, no. Diane, I'm going to try I did not see this in the bag on. until Bill. I hate it you saw that. I bought one for you. I like peanuts in Good, mine. I'll eat both of them then. <laughs> 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 he said that real quick, y'all. Y'all heard that, right? No, I'm definitely going to try the reptile glue, though. Okay, so let's say I want to just add a little something here. And a little another little strip right there. Let's see what we can use here. Just a sliver of something. Bill, what are my crappy friends saying on here? Uh, ten to seven. These stickers are beautiful. I'm really, I just have to go on. I just have to look at this because this is so cute. It's got bookshelves and stuff on there too. Does anyone else have, is anyone on here a teacher? Do we have teachers on here? Susan says, oh man, now I'm thinking of chocolates again. <laughs> just when you thought. Marlene Watts says, sounds like I'm going to go to, have to go to the gym if I eat Hershey's. Mmm. Marlene, don't do it. Lisa Christian says, where do you find the reptile glue? You find it on, you can find that on You went Amazon. and looked it up, didn't you? Yeah, I did. You looked it up, yeah. Just put in reptile glue and go to Amazon. Let me see this polka dot paper over here. Let me see. I've been looking at this. I know we used this the other day when you were doing your card making. Let's see if that will work on there. Here's the thing that's interesting to me about the reptile glue. I've never tried it, but when I look at the description and the fact that they have to ship it, uh, make sure that it's not it's not below forty degrees, et cetera, et cetera, and the reviews on it, it looks like it could be in the same category with art glitter glue, except you're paying one third the price, possibly. But I don't know. So I hate to steer someone in the wrong direction. They get it, say builders art reptile glue sucks. It's your fault. <laughs> you know. I'm, making, I'm trying to make a spine for this. That's what I'm thinking about doing on this. I like the green on there. I like the green. I'm going with the green, y'all. So Carrie Woods teaches sixth grade. Oh, nice. Carrie, sixth grade is incredible. You know what? Sixth grade, sixth grade is no joke. That's the turning point for Ariel. Ooh. That's what she, she learned study skills in the sixth grade that she actually used in college. But those sixth graders, mm. <laughs> I went to a school to talk uh, to some sixth graders. Um, they invited me to a school to talk about my what it's like to be a, a, um, an author. And um, yeah, those those sixth graders <laughs> gotta love them. So kudos to you, Carrie, teaching them sixth graders. Well, oh, this is gonna be fun. Y'all see how I measure, right? Does anyone else do this? <laughs> I just don't have the time to be measuring every detail, unless I have to. But when I'm just kind of crafting in my room, it's just kind of... When I'm recording for y'all, though, 
I just do my thing. Yeah, I, then I'll then I'll give measurements. But when I'm doing stuff like this, I just kind of line it up and measure. And I almost made it. This is going to be a very colorful teacher book. So, Bill, what's going on here? Oh, thanks, Carrie Donna. Woods, Carrie Woods says, one knows it has been a long week at school when one makes copies to insert data on and the copies are blank. Mm. And I have to run back to the school to make more co copies. Oh, my goodness. I hope she doesn't encounter any students. Poor thing. Before well, it's Monday. Saturday. You can still encounter a student. Trust me. <laughs> Thank goodness it's Saturday. Go home, student. You know what? But it's never, the work is never done because I'm sure right now Carrie's probably working. You know? I want to give this thing a spine. I'm determined to have a spine on this thing. You know? Look at that. Janice, she says she's taught a combined fourth and fifth grade. Hmm. It's Taz Holden. I'm just putting a little bit of glue in here. Art. I'm not even going to say it. Hooper glue. Kania. I said it wrong, didn't I? Huh? Taz Holden. Oh, she wrong. got a good name. I, I love her name. Bill's afraid to mess up your I name. Know, that, that name is too that name pretty is to mess too up. Pretty to ne mess up. You do, do not say it, Bill. Say it. Don't say it. It can only be looked at. So a lot of people usually say to wet your paper a little bit um, to kind of get it to kind of give a little bit. But I'm just kind of just gently, gently wedging it. This is going to be a nice full book for the teacher. Nice and full. Nice full book, so I'm just kind of giving it a little bit. Y'all are seeing this fun full live. I was like, maybe I should do this in the tutorial, but I wasn't. I said, let me do it live so y'all could just craft along with Brian me and Dickie watch. Says, hey, he's, he's watching us as he cleans his craft room. Oh, nice. Hopefully, this will make it go a little bit more. I need to clean my craft room seriously. Huh. Every time I try stuff like this, yeah, what happened? This trying and you gets find yourself room. making a project. These somehow get into the room whenever I try. Let me move this out of the way. I'm going to get some a... peanut butter. That's what I'm going to do. I bought it so I could stick it in peanut butter and eat it. There you go. Does it's, anyone else do that? It's a modified uh, Reese's cup. I should have put more glue without being a cup. Right? It's Sabrina, two sweet creations. Hey, Sabrina. Look, did you see Sabrina's? Ooh. Sabrina put Sabrina some donuts put some in donut. there. Look, a lot of y'all are my Facebook friends. I'm watching y'all. I'm supposed to be on a diet. I was I'm like, watching y'all on Facebook. This donut up in here. <laughs> See, no. It was all <sighs> drippy. It looked like you could, you, could just, you could just put it in your mouth. You didn't even need teeth. They just slide right in. That's how good they look. Yes. I'm just having fun over here. Don't mind me. I'm just having a little bit of fun. Let's see. Look, it's already... This is bulky, babe. Look how bulky that is. Hmm. Oh, Jerry Reed, crazy. Yes. Has your favorite in the oven. Oh, boy. What's that? Mac and cheese? No, she says she's making an, she has an apple pie in the oven. <gasps> oh, my goodness. No, y'all stop it. She loves apple pie with vanilla ice cream. I do. She can eat it every day if you let her. My book is not going to close. I'm going to have to cut my book down, y'all. Ooh, Sabrina for I'm gonna have to cut Sweet my book Sweet Creation down. says her husband said he was gonna put put her out if he didn't make any for the house. Man, I would have to be. You know what? If I lived anywhere close to Sabrina, Sabrina can cook. She's Sabrina, not playing, okay. Look, Sabrina, I would have to um, <laughs> I would have to have a treadmill like right in the kitchen, right at the dinner table, just <laughs> just be right there, okay. Okay, I want my book to be able to Diane really Solomon close says, Bill, up. are you going to order any Echo Park Christmas paper packs to put in the store? Uh, I don't, we, we don't have that? We have the, um, yeah, we do. It's a couple of them. We have the six by six now. You, you want, you're talking about the big ones. The then, 12 right? by 12s. Yeah, those are going to be, yeah, we're going to carry those. Yeah, we're going to get those later. Yeah. 
Those are coming. Those are coming. Okay, so y'all, I had to cut off that tab, but guess what? When you're mindless crafting, it's okay. We have 83 people here. Nice. Y'all watch. I already noticed because Mimi B says, what? Uh, only 32 thumbs? Mm. Y'all see what I'm doing here? Look what I'm doing, y'all. It's not the right length, so guess what? It's too long, so guess what? You cut it shorter. Mindless craft. But you know what? Even if you let the red be longer, it still would have came out cool. Yeah, but this is too flimsy. It's just very flimsy there. But that's all right. That's okay. Y'all are seeing it happen. See, I would have made it up and down, but you were obviously going to turn it the other way. Huh? What? <laughs> yeah, that was right. <laughs> I'm sure the teacher wouldn't mind. That's really coming out oh, good. Now Lisa I got it. Christian has a question. Let me go look. I might have missed it. Lisa, uh, For those of you that are still tuned, that are just tuning in, we're making an envelope flip book. Oh. Oh, man. What's Lisa Christian says, do another score at a quarter inch away from the fold. That was a good while ago. You may have done it since then. Hmm? No, I haven't scored anything. Okay. If you buffer or do something ridiculous, just refresh the page. I think that might be good right there. Let's see. We'll see if this holds down. If not, I got another thing to come. Right. This is this right here. Don't do this because I cut it just a little bit short. So we're going to let that we're going to let that dry for a little bit. We're just going to let that dry. I need those clip things, but hey, if I missed some of those questions. I apologize. Don't have it. Yes, Johnny P. He likes the stickles glitter. Me too. I call it stickle juice. He does. I love that. Oh, this is coming together. This is coming together. It is looking kind of cute. It's I want to see you add the other stuff. You got to really. Oh yeah, this stuff is. You got to pimp that out. We're just her. we're just laying down the foundation for what's possible. You but I, this I should have cut a little bit longer. So those are just, this part right here should have been just a little bit longer. But you know what? It's okay. Well, there you go. It's okay. Let me refresh my screen again. Yes, if you're buffering, refresh the screen. Refresh the screen. If you happen to be buffering. Yeah, I'm just like getting this to really lay down real good on here. So we'll see what happens. But y'all are seeing this unfold live just because. And if you want, you can add some little something right along here and have a little fold over for this. Let's see if we can. <laughs> Uh-oh. Let me see if I can create one, right? <laughs> Makes me nervous. Okay. Okay. I think I can do it. I cut the other one off, but I think this will work. Let's see if I can get this to um let's see if I can get this to work. We'll see. This is just fun. If y'all haven't tried this yet and you want it like you're in a crafty funk, start getting some envelopes. And just start gluing them together and see what happens. Don't try to figure it all out. Don't try to figure Maybe it all out. Maybe he says refresh number five, but in Tracy's voice. It's, it's okay. <laughs> Not in my voice. Refresh your screens right now. <laughs> Y'all are funny. Brian Dickey says, strange, buffering and video playing at the same time. Hmm. Yeah, that's kind of strange. Me too, Loopy. She says she had to refresh because the feed froze. I, I, have, I don't know what's I going am on. determined to have this come out. Determined to have this little flap, huh? Hi, Marie Muscle. Muscle? M U S S I L L. Muscle. There you go. It could be muscle. Marie. <laughs> oh, 
Kathy says, being here with all of you and Tracy and I makes me happy. We're happy also. We're happy Kathy. too. Y'all are just the best. Yeah, Kathy, we're, I'm, I'm just working it out. Just working this out, trying to do my own thing here. I did that before too, Jerry. Jerry had to go all the way back out and back in and seems to be working. I had to go all the way back out on the TV and come back in. I don't know what the problem is. I want this flap on here, y'all. I am determined to get this little flap on here. Ooh, Kathleen. Kathleen. What's she at? Oops. Kathleen German, she made noodles with sharp cheese, jalapeno jack cheese, provolone cheese, and ham with Italian dressing. You can ready to get off, aren't you, Cheese? Gee, that's a lot of cheese, ain't it? Look, it's the German. In German. Mm, mm, mm. So are you going to add any cheese? <laughs> Just kidding. Hey, Donna said, Donna Salas is telling Kathleen German to send that in for the recipe swap. Oh, oh, yes. Oh, Marie Muscle, uh, Tracy's making a folding card. She so just got here. I'm making an envelope flip book. So we started, yeah. let me just show y'all, for those of y'all tuning in, this is what we started with so far. We started with three envelopes, three envelopes, and we're, um, you know, we're just going to, yeah. I covered them with some pretty paper, and this is going to be for a teacher. Yeah, that's what I wanted to say, Marie. That thing. <laughs> Ooh, Kathleen German also prepared ham with pineapples, brown sugar, and honey. Okay, we need a, a oh, ham we'll recipe. Be over. We'll be over. The whole group is coming. Everyone's coming. All, the, all 65 of us. <laughs> Look at this. Uh-oh. Wait a minute now. <laughs> Wait a minute now. Now I meant what I meant to do was leave this a little bit. This is gonna be pretty bulky, but that's okay. This is gonna be pretty bulky. And it's still, okay. but that's okay though. Look how cute that is. Well, I gotta put my stickers in there. That's, and that's all right. That's why you leave a little bit of space when you're first gluing it down. Let me show you so you don't do what I just did. And this is why I like to, I don't think there's perfection in crafting, but it all comes together. I would leave out just a little bit more space here when you're gluing this down right here. Leave a little bit more room there, a little more wiggle room there. Well, the more of them you do, the better you get. Right. The more of them you do, and I've done a couple of these before and it's still, you know, hey. <laughs> But guess what? The teacher's not going to say she should have scored at this thing and she should have done this. They're going to be like, oh my goodness. This is the best gift ever. This so, is kind of cool. So though, once look how that is coming together. I'm dying to see how you pimp it out. Are you going to put that you mean, the, When you say how there? I pimp it out, how I decorate it? Yes. Oh, okay. Well, there you go. Like pimp my ride. <laughs> you understand the movie Pimp My Ride? I just love that it would take the most beat up looking vehicle you ever seen in your life. The only thing you'd ever think to do with it is maybe shoot it with a bazooka. But by the time Pimp My Ride got through with it, please. It was the baddest thing you ever seen in town. This is Pimp My Envelope. <laughs> oh, y'all. Bill, it, it, it figures Bill will come I up with some of these. I kind of like it in the middle of that green. Does it bend if you do it like that? So much you can do. I'm just showing y'all. Yeah, like that. that There's just so much that you can do with this. Actually, I like it right there. I'm just on that one. Okay. She's on one, huh? This is supposed to be... I don't have a whole lot of this. So, <laughs> I only have room for one. Uh, I'm going to put it right here. I have room for one. Sounds like a song to me, babe. You know what I'm saying? Right there. Y'all see my measuring? Ah, right about there looks good. Cut. Amethyst LaBeat says she loved that show. Pit my ride, boy. Now, is this... This might be... 
sometimes the washi tapes that you get just don't stick the way you want. Like this is not going to really stick the way I would like it to. It really isn't. So we'll see what happens here. I'm using my art gritter. And I got a I got I just placed an order because I really need some of this glue. I, this is one of the things I cannot run out of, and Bill uses a ton of it when he crafts. That's why I need reptile glue. Well, <laughs> we're gonna get one for me, for you, and I think it'll be fun. I am. I'm gonna try it. See you do a review on it. And me and Diane can can get the report on reptile glue. That little black strip, y'all. That little black strip. That little black. Yeah, it did come out kind of cute. Strip right on there. It's like a bold kind of thing going on there. See? The flap didn't work. The other flap that they had on it, so I made my own flap. Jennifer Peck says, does the art glitter glue, or does it actually have glitter in it? No, it does not. Then why do they call it that? Good question. Oh, that's going to be cute with the little apple. Isn't that going to be cute, y'all? Look, if you don't have that um, teacher appreciation stamp set, you got to get it, y'all. you got to get it. It's so adorable. Um, let's see if I can find it here. And I have the video on how to make this. This, this actually started out, let's see. It started out like this. Okay. And I decorated with some of the, got some like scraps together and decorated it. And then Kathy's I stamped it out. She says with, she... I stamped it out uh, using this. She's your appreciation stamp set. She says that washi tape really made it pop. Didn't that washi tape do some stuff? So imagine, I think this looks like an apple, but someone said this is too, too thick. It's supposed to be a pumpkin. But I made it into an apple. <laughs> I made it into an apple, y'all. I couldn't help it. Louise Cassius says, very nice. I like it. I like the ideas. You gave me so many good ideas on making making sure I get a chance to try it out. Yeah, don't try to go for perfection. Just just do it because you want to do something fun. You just know? do you. Yeah, just, just do, do your thing, okay? Whatever you come up with is what you come up with. Right. So let's go ahead and decorate this. This front cover because why is it the front cover? Because um, you can hot glue it on here, but I, the art glitter glue has really been good at holding stuff on. But if I need to hot glue it, I will. Exactly. Susan Stewart says, "Do freestyle." That's what it is. It's about that freestyling, right? That's gonna be cute. I got all of this, all of this space to play with. Look at all of this. Right? So the store is rolling. She's rolling. Rolling on laugh. I don't know. What does rolling mean again? Rolling on the floor, baby. No, it's the L O R O L F. Huh? R, R rolling on L floor. <laughs> rolling on the floor. No, it, it, it's not right. Uh, rolling on. I don't know. Bill, I'm telling you. You sure? Is that what I mean? You know, all these abbreviations. We need an internet abbreviation book. Okay. Bill, for those that want to still pick this stamp set up, um, can someone put the link in there for me? Oh, certainly. For that. For that. That's going to be good, too. I'll be happy to do I that. I am in love with this. I'm, I'm going to decorate the inside right now, y'all. This is going to be too bulky, but I'm going to use a, a couple of them. This is the sticky notes, y'all. Dot every I and cross every T, right? So. Okay, I just put that link in there. For that this is the closed portion of, you know, this is what it comes in like, like this. But what a nice little decoration. Take a couple of these off of here, right? That link I put in will take you directly to that teacher's appreciation thing. 
That's going to be bulky. You can actually put some of these in the envelope for the teacher, too, so she can have, or he can have some of these. Oh, there you go. Right? So I just kind of toned this down a little bit, but some of the extras I might just slip in there. I don't know. Just see, see how it goes. See how it goes here. I feel like I got something stuck on my scissors. All this cutting, huh? So how are my friends doing? How are they doing? Oh, can you please tell? I'm it in. Okay, I saw that. They're putting the link in right now. Oh, the links are there. Louise. Right above her. Okay, there we go. I have a feeling after this live, I'll probably have to order more paper. More of this, um, this school days. Yeah, show a teacher or bus driver, whoever, that you really appreciate what they're doing. So I'm using that backing that's on here, but you can actually take a backing if you want from something else, like some sturdy cardstock or whatever, right? And you can do that. So whose idea was this? Someone came up with this idea. I thought it was great. What was it? To glue this on. Oh, I think it's very broad. Because I, I glued this shut, y'all. So yeah, <laughs> I glued it shut. So let's put it right here. You can write a little note to the teacher in here. Don't forget your college professors. And this is not this is in no way giving them a, a bribe gift. You're just <laughs> to get a better grade. Louise, it's okay. She says, I'm new on here on here, and I'm sorry about asking all these questions. Oh no, no, welcome, no. Welcome, no. first of all. But welcome, Louise. Feel free as many questions as you want. Yes, welcome, welcome. We have pros in here who can answer anything. Look, these EK Success stickers at Dollar Tree. I was shocked when I saw them. See, you can slip these right in here for the teacher. Right, so now everything is coming together. Now, if you want... If you don't want to use everything and then you want to you have several teachers you want to give to these are from Dollar Tree. Bertha Bus Wilson is here. Hey Bertha. Let's see what we got here. Detroit is in the house. Oh look at these, these little things here. Oh, cute. See, I can take one of these and glue it right on, but I could slip these in here too for the teacher. Or you, you can make a slip. You can put a, a, a gift card in here as well for, for the teacher. Well, if someone wanted to, they can make a slit and then stick it in. You know what I mean? But the whole thing, you know, like it goes across, the slit goes in and you stick the card and the whole thing. You could do some pockets. Yep. Yeah, like that. Mm -hmm. You sure can. Yeah, they that's want a good, That's a good idea. So you can make several of these for the teacher and then just kind of put them in there. So I'm going to just cut a few of these up so I could say, oh, these won't fit. Okay. But if you cut it down and make it fit, put a Starbucks card, some kind of little gift card for the teacher, um, put some, you could put some tea packets in there. Just, just giving you some ideas. Kathy said she was going to go out, but, but decided to give her husband a list instead and torture him. <laughs> I said to torture her. But... Kathy, you need to go ahead and... Uh... <laughs> Put on that boot and walk outside. Y'all are funny. Okay, so let me see what else I have here that I can use. I'm going to drop some stuff on the floor, y'all. Merlin Watts says, school days, school days, good old golden rule days, reading and writing and arithmetic. She says can't remember the rest of the words. Uh, you know what? That's I was gonna say that sounds familiar. Reading and writing is arithmetic. A fundamental. I don't know what it is, but Robert Rennes just said, so whose teacher is getting this? <coughs> well, we don't have any kids in school, but a teacher is going to get this. I have teacher friends also. Look at that pencil. Adorable. 
It's coming on. It has a lot of activity on it. Yes, it does. It's fun. It's fun. It's fun and it's unique. See, now, I, these stickers are really good. But for some reason, I still felt like I need to put something on there. Susan Stewart says she's lucky if her husband even makes it almost everything on the list. He doesn't read the labels. <laughs> I don't read I look at the colors. Oh, yeah. I brought the wrong stuff before. It was green, but this ain't it. <laughs> oh, I love this. This sticker says, I believe I and fly. achieve. Oh, well, okay. I believe. I... Let's put that there. Believe and achieve right there. So now you can have fun with the stickers, y'all. Looks like somebody's mailbox got we, knocked down by the trash people. We gotta have those guys can't drive. No, I'm talking about oh, somebody. On the, oh, on I'm, the I'm live. looking outside. I'm over here looking outside. <laughs> no, someone on the live uh -huh. said uh, <laughs> that mailbox got knocked over. Tracy was looking out the window. I was. I was like, like who? <laughs> this right here. You see how bulky this thing can really get? Seriously. But it's cool, though. I like the little bit of added touches, the little pencil, the little bad, the little, you know? I know. It's just so The more fun you do, you know. Oh, well, I like how that little black breaks out and it kind of matches, ties in the black down there. Almost the rule of thirds. Almost. Quite. If you wanted to, you can get one of those Velcro things huh, and put it on each end so they can snap it for clothes. Yes, you can. That would be cute to hold it. I have some ribbon, though, that I'll be using. Because I may have to do the Velcro snaps on there. That's a good idea, babe. I could do it like this, right? It can stay like this, too. That's the other thing. So, so much you can do with it. I wanted to put my apple right there. Wait hmm. a minute. This thing come up right. The chat says, look at this though. The chat says, tell, telling Kathy, you're blessing and clever, killing two flies at once. You don't need to go out and your husband gets some free time. No, Kathy gets the free time. Her husband is not free right now. He's working for <laughs> Kathy. Okay? <laughs> Kathy's the only one benefiting from this. But but he's he's you know what he's he's getting, gonna eat though. Well, you know he's he's receiving love too. There you go. Because when he goes home and sees Kathy, look at him with that oh <laughs> that look. She's like she loves me. I love that she loves me. You know how you have works. Yes, Bill. We we he, I'm hearing you. Now people talk about Velcro dots. So let me see. Oh yeah. yes, the Velcro Someone, dots. Jennifer said. Something about putting Velcro enclosure or something. Then later on. Yes, because you can snap it closed with this, actually. You can do this, babe. Let me pull it. Oh. Where is it you can do it right here. You can close it up like this. Right. It is. Brian Dickey said he found some Velcro dots at Dollar Tree. Oh, my goodness. Back to Dollar Tree the for the Velcro out. dots. Because I kind of like it like this. I actually do like it like this a lot. So that means, you see that mindless crafting? You don't know what the end is going to be like, but whatever it is, it's going to be fun. So I need to tie in. That's a nice here. look. This is really sticky. Seriously, y'all don't really have to put this glue on here, but it's just a habit of mine. But I got to get this on here, though. This can be a magnet if you want, and then slip it in there. So I guess if I'm going to put that apple on here, it would have to go on this back cover right here. Well, there you go. But if the teacher wants to take this. Then we tell her you can't. I have it. No, I'm saying, no, I'm saying if she wants to take it and do something else with it, she can. Or he. She or he. You can put it on that white part on the inside. You know what I'm saying? 
What do you think? It's too bulky. It's going to be pretty bulky, but we could do it. We could do it. Yeah. Right oh, there. oh, oh, oh. Look how nice that right, is. Right, right there. That'll work. Do it. And then get one of those little string things that they go around the middle. You know what I'm talking about? Well, y'all were saying now to do the, the tab on it. But for now, I can do one of the string things. Yeah. Or you can make this a magnet. You don't have to glue this down. I'm just showing y'all what's possible. Hi, Donna Jo. She says, are y'all alive now? I just got in my car. Donna Jo. what Joe. do I know? You're on. We are live. How dare you be on? Yeah, this is the second time. You're right. So second time today. Ooh, I don't want to put glue on it, that. You're paper. right, Kathy. It, it does look good on that paper. Because you have enough red on the paper. To tie everything in. To and you got the pencil. Yeah, it's really so cute. It's so cute. This is a pumpkin, y'all, that's now an apple. I mean, the possibilities are endless. And on the sticky note, if you want, you can write a little note to the teacher right on the sticky note there. This is the Dollar Tree sticky notes. The chat says, better safe than sorry, Tracy. You can't go wrong with double gluing. Right. This and if I need to hot glue this down, I can. But there's some other things you can do with that, like put some um, uh, backing on it and use it as a magnet. Just another idea. For those of you out there that don't have cats, I just found out my cat can open the door <laughs> from the opposite direction. Hey. Don't ask me how he's able to do it, okay? Unless it's absolutely shut for real, nothing stops him. Her. Her, whatever. She's very adventurous. Seriously. She will end up anywhere, okay? Woo, this is this is bulky, babe. This is It's okay though. Bulky is good. Let me see. See, I didn't know how this was going to end up. I would give myself a little more give on that. You know. Oh, this looks so substantial, y'all. I love it. I am loving you it. You get one of those, uh, what, you know what I'm talking about, Tracy? One of those, uh. <laughs> Renee Neighbors is funny. Um, let's see what I got here. I have some ribbon here. Oh, yes, you uh, can use the band. Uh, refresh your screen. You sure can. Let me see if I have one. Mm. See if I have one of those elastic hair bands or whatever. Or clips. Well, maybe not. Maybe it's Ariel has one. Ariel probably has one. I don't think I can get anything else in this book. This envelope flip book. No, this is just uh, Oh, no, I need a big, big one. Look at that. That doesn't even hold that together the way it needs to. That's the next She might have something. I need one. You know what? I think one of the bands, one of those hair bands would be perfect for this. What do y'all think? Yeah, right. You could put a magnet on the back of that apple and use it as a magnet and then put it inside. Yeah, that's another idea. You can use the apple as a paperweight on her papers uh, to grade. Yep, you can do that too. See this right here? Belly band. No, I'll show an area. One oh, just give me one of just give me one of her um yeah. One of her bands, her things that she uses for her hair. What's those things called? Oh, she, she, she probably has a ton of those. Look, y'all, when you don't have that though, right? <laughs> Until they find that, look. Well, this will do. Uh, try this. I think this will work. Mm-hmm. Oh, yes. This is going to work. Look, if y'all hadn't gotten these yet from Dollar Tree, you need to get these. And these are... They come in five in a pack. Five of them in a pack, okay? I think this needs like a little slit, like a button or so, something from, something fun on this part right here. Well, right on here, like something real fun on there. Haven't figured it out on yet. What? On this. 
This right here. On the band? Yeah. We'll see. I thought I had something, though. Oh, let's see. My cart. Deborah Artery says, tie the ribbon onto the band. You gotta make a little small miniature bowl looking thing with points. Maybe. Wait a minute, wait, wait. Let's see what we can do with this. Maybe V says add a tag. You can add tags in there. Oh, I'm not finished yet. We're gonna keep going on this. Carrie Wood says, I think I need a Dollar Tree run as a reward for doing all the schoolwork on a Saturday. When I yes, should, you do. When I should be crafting. Yes, you do. There you go. You said it. It's so nice to have so many crafty friends in my craft room right now. This is fun. This has been really fun. Y'all need to go ahead and make this. Seriously. It doesn't have to be a teacher, you know, even if it's a someone at a daycare, you know, pre-K teacher, whichever. Okay, let me, let me see how this can work here. Brian says one of his indoor dogs opened the front door this morning, left it cracked open, and he opened it. And he had to swing it toward the inside. Exactly. That's what our cat does. <laughs> he pulls the door towards himself somehow. Carrie Wood says that she will say that we gave her permission to go to Dollar Tree. Mm. The fags. There you go. Carrie, we gave you permission. They got such, you can find so much there. And there was just a ton of stuff that we, did, we didn't pick up because we need to go come back here and, and, <laughs> oh, and go the, live. The baby, the baby Karen says, Tracy and Bill, there were was the equivalent of the Academy Awards for crafting. You two would be number one. Aww. But Tracy, you are truly one talented person. Love to you both. Karen. Aww, you're so sweet. Thank you, Thank Karen. Thank you. I appreciate that. So I can add all kinds. There's so much more you can add on this. Oh, my goodness. Diane it's Solomon says the charm will look cute hanging on the band also. That would, too. See, there you go. See? Well, we'd never get off this live, will we? <laughs> And you don't have to go to the middle. You can go to this right on the other side of that school rules days, whatever it says. School days? Yeah, right on the other side of it. Like right here? Yeah, because it's still going to close. Yes. You can, yeah. Mm -hmm. You can do all kinds of stuff. See what y'all can do? Now I got to add some. I got to still. Y'all still with me here? I got to add some more stuff. Kathy says, now I have to send my hub with the Ollie's to look for those envelopes. <laughs> I'm sending him a you, Joanne's to give me the blade my shirt. I might as well send him a Tuesday morning too. For some for some kind of free time y'all were talking about. Y'all are so funny. Please. Bill, I need gems. What kind of gems? I feel like I need gems, but no. Like, like playing a fitness gym? Them. Gems, not gem gems. Oh. Bill, <laughs> is it in like, here? Like Planet Fitness Gym, gems, <laughs> gem, gems, babe. Is it? What about this? Is it in here? <laughs> like Planet Fitness gems. <laughs> I feel like I need to add some stitching, y'all. About this stuff? because it wouldn't be a crafty thing if I didn't have. You know, you're gonna find a way to get stitching on everything. I can't help it, y'all. Look how adorable this is. Oh, my goodness. Y'all better make one of these. Oh, Chris the Cop said, we all know a teacher. Her name is Tracy Phillips. Oh. That is so sweet. Man, y'all y'all are just... <sighs> Barbara Bubbler says, I was trying to think of what I can make to put my note papers in. This will work. Perfect for that. Isn't this the cutest? Your students are going to want to make one. I mean, you would never... Look, make students make these for y'all. For you teachers, this can be their project. <laughs> this is your project for me. Uh, oh, Diane Solomon says she got some um the envelopes. Oh, after Christmas at Walgreens, one dollar. Yeah, I've had these envelopes in my stash, y'all, for an entire 
a little over a year. I've had this Mimi for a while. Mimi says you have stitching on the apple. Stacy, yes, Stacy I know. has stitching on everything. I'm really tempted to put it on on this too. I just can't help it. I could have swore you had stitching on I the macaroni and cheese the corner, last week. <laughs> Somehow, don't ask me how it happened. Y'all are funny. Yes, y'all, the envelope flip book. If you're ever in a rut and you're just not sure what else to to do, just add some of this stuff on here. And just have fun with it. Have fun with it. Everything doesn't, have to, everything doesn't have to match. Carrie Woods is telling Brian Dickey that her youngest taught the dog to open the refrigerator to get him pop, but it kind of backfired on him because he started opening all the doors everywhere. <laughs> That's one thing about a dog. When you teach a dog something, please. Mm. This is, what's our, we got a school song, babe. We can sing that school song. Uh, hopefully YouTube won't red flag us. Please. We have a children's um, school song. That's true, Susan. School song. She says white business envelopes will work for even used ones. For yeah, bill, for seriously. Yep, seriously. Y'all don't have don't overthink it. Oh, that's gonna tie that Just together. do it. Black just make thing. it make it fun and just, you know, something that a teacher would just absolutely love. I think it's a good idea. Put a magnet on that, y'all. Put a magnet on that, insert it in there as another gift. Put some gift cards in there. Put some tea packets in there for the teacher because teachers need a break. Seriously. <laughs> like Kathy says, I'm so loving when you do a project like this. You're teaching an old dog a new trick. Oh, thank you. Because guess what? I'm going back to school. I'm going back to school. I forgot the song, babe. And, and I will, I read, will and write. read and write. And try with all my might. I'm going back to school. I'm going back to school. Sorry to rush. Gotta catch the bus. I'm back at school. There you go, babe. That was it. The weather starts to get real cool. And now it's time for back to school. Hurry, hurry. Don't be late. This is such a special day. I'm going back to school. I forgot the first verse, y'all. I'm going back to school <laughs> so I can read and write. Oh, wait a minute. Bertha, all look, mic. Bertha has the, the nerve, okay? She said, so I have to go watch from the beginning so I can see the measurements. <laughs> Bertha, good luck because there are no measurements. <laughs> Let me see the envelope. Let me show you the envelopes. Uh, measurement. I could give the. I could give you that right now. Um. Ooh, it was on the packaging, and the packaging is somewhere around here. Brian Dickey says he's currently working on craft fair products. He share them on YouTube and Instagram when he's finished. Oh, nice. Let's see what the, see what the number, Brian Dickey comes up with. This is a number ten policy size envelope and it's nine and three eighths by four and one eighth so good luck with that y'all <laughs> good luck with that hold up deborah i just was oh, potting on the food she said she caught her dog trying to open the oven door while the chicken was cooking and the other dog was sitting and watching mm, conspiring your dog's a little too smart. Yeah, that's a little bit much, okay? That's like a Doberman gang. <laughs> you better gang. watch them. Remember the Doberman gang, Tracy? Those were the smartest oh, yeah, dogs yeah, I've yeah, ever yeah. seen in my that's life. Okay? That, that, that was the show back in the day. After that, everybody was trying to buy Dobermans. For any of y'all that are old school like us, let's see. Oh, this, look at this. Somebody sent me this washi tape in Happy Mail. I'm using it. Y'all better get all your stuff out. All that stuff that you're saving. Uh, uh, Susan Stewart says, uh, are they standard business envelope size? I don't know, but this is, I just read off the uh, measurements for this thing. Nine and three eighths by four and one eighth. Kathleen German says you can use any size. You it. really can. You could ju just improvise. It does not have to be the exa this, this exact size. Oh, I'm liking this. 
Look at y'all. Look, y'all. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it because I like it. Now, this washi tape doesn't like really... Look, I'm saying it doesn't stick very well, but it sure is sticking to my hand pretty good. <laughs> Diane Solomon says, save that bag, Trace, to use on something else. What bag? This bag? Oh, yeah. That. Oh, this right here? Yeah, you actually could. You could do that. Isn't it cute? Look at that. It just has like, it's real pretty. It has a nice little scene on it. Y'all don't tell me to keep things, okay? Bill is already like, can I throw this out? Can I throw this out? What about this? What about this? <laughs> Kathy asked if I sing in a... I do not sing in a choir. Um, Only by choice. I don't think that I... <clears throat> you know. Please. I don't... <laughs> I don't think that I sing like like that bad, but... Um, what it is, you, you actually do. I can carry you, a tune. You just do so many things that... But I'm singing for... for from my heart, though. But that's that's what it's all about. Though. Yep, that's what it's all about. Ultimately, that's what it's all about. Yep. Mm -hmm. Look, I read something somewhere. It says, sing as though no one is listening. There you go. That's how you should live your life. Live as though no one is watching. Right. So anything Bill, well, then, well do, right now, you have a bunch of people watching us on, um, <laughs> on here right now. Okay. Look, Bill's like... <laughs> Do anything you want to do as long as you don't step on someone else's toes. That's all. There you go. Yeah, so that Back to School song was one of the songs that me and uh, Bill wrote together. Um, That's true. Back in the day when we were writing children's music. It wasn't too long ago, was it? No, it wasn't. We did the Back to School song and then we did the... Um, we did that the album. We have the, the album. ABC song and we have uh we wrote our own yes, ABC song each album. and then we did uh what was that? Oh my favorite one though That's is one. the Days of the Week song. Hands down, mm. the Days of the Week, okay? I'm afraid to sing it because you two I like know, I tell you, like red flag school it. song is nice if, because if you really go listen to it on Little Storybooks, I put the funk on that. Trust me. Cause I kids like to jump around. I read yeah, something with Michael Jackson. He made a little. Yeah. He likes to test out his music on kids, and if they jump around, that's when he know he has a winner. So I was determined to have that music bouncing all over the place, and it has a real nice thing going on with it. Oh, Donna sadly says she likes the fall song. <laughs> the fall song is nice too. Yeah, it is. We talked. But I I did a song called Great, uh, for the kids. We wrote that song. And um, because I wanted to have kind of an empowerment song for kids that even if they're young, they still have these great abilities that they're going to step into. And that, they, that at some point in their lives, they're going to step into their greatness. And so I wanted to start that message early on and put it in a song. Um, right. Build yeah. self-esteem. So that song was called, um, it's called I'm Great. It's called I'm Great. Mm -hmm. We did a couple songs for Martin Luther King. Uh, one of them ended up being... Uh, Ranked as one in the top five on the grill for MSNBC is one of the top five songs that uh, kids should listen to for the Martin Luther King Day. Yeah, that was. Uh, I was kind of surprised when they, that happened. We just wrote that song, you know, from the heart for the kids. You know, you just never know what's going to take off. You know, so um, I can do anything. I'm great. Yeah, that was a good one. If I believe it's never too late. If you want, no, if it's going to be, then it's up to me. I'm great. I'm great. I'm great. Right. There you it's, go. Because you want to talk. <laughs> I forgot the words. The lyrics are really good. It was more lyrics than that, but if you really think about that, if it's going to be, it's, it's up, up to, to me. me. Yep. And I have to say that I'm great. It doesn't matter what anyone else says. The people around me, my so-called friends, even family members. I have to say it. Yep. I remember, who was it? Uh, and adults need to hear that too. Because I think sometimes as adults, we forget our way. We we forget, um, you know, we, we, for, we, we lose our way. Because people start to tell us what should we should do and how we should do it and... 
You just got to go and find your own to way. It. You, you really do. The it, world will define you, okay? Abraham Lincoln <laughs> said, whether you believe you can or believe you can't, in either case, it's true. Yep. <clears throat> right. Bill, I'm loving this. I mean, this has just gone like... <laughs> I could keep adding stuff to this because it's so fun. Michelle Kerr says, can the envelopes still be used if they're glued shut? No, huh? just take, you have to cut it. Yeah, we you yeah, you just have to um, get a, it, Oh, you mean like if you if you make a slit here? Yeah, make a what, slit. Like if this is glued shut, you mean? You can like make a slit on this side. You can just look, you can just cut off a little slit. If the envelope happens to be shut. And now it's open. Yeah, there you go. But you want this flap really helps, though, to form it. Chris, so imagine you just took this and went, you went from this to this. I hope y'all are inspired by this. I had fun doing this. And I feel like I want to add some more stickers. Chris is talking about her. Uh, her, her she has a squeaky voice or something because of surgery. She used to like to sing and stuff like that. But I tell you what, there are people on the radio that have squeaky voices and all kind of stuff that became quite famous. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So when do y'all craft? Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. These are the days of the week. That song was that song where it was really great at teaching kids <laughs> the days of the week. We had parents who would email us from all over the place and see it. My, I had the most trouble trying to teach my kids the days of the week. And Ooh. this song right here did his job. It really did. Yeah. Jan 34 says she made a wallet holder for a little girl one day from one of those envelopes. What are you reading, Tracy? We should be crafting on any day of the week that ends in Y. <laughs> that's uh, all of them. Isn't that's it? every day, okay? Oh. <laughs> exactly. Any day of the week is a crafty, a crafting day. Yep. Okay, so there you go. In a nutshell. That actually looks kind of cute with that, uh, that I love school. This has a lot of stuff. Look at this. And so imagine the teacher Damn. opens this up. Bam, bam. Ooh, look what such and such gave to me. Bam, stickers. He's I'm sorry, you the teacher Bam. for grades. No, no, he's not. Bam. Give me an A, teacher. Bam. Give me an A. Stars. Give it to your high school And then you're going to throw some teacher. extras in there, like some gift, some gift, um, gift card or something. Uh, bam, more stickers for the teacher to use. Uh, let's see what else we could throw in there. Just want y'all to see if y'all are tuning in late. All the stuff that's going in here. Let's see. All right. There's more of these two. Now this is a little bit sticky, so let's see. Let me go get some paper, y'all. Diane said, Solomon says she guided her 10-year-old nephew to make a car for his pap. His idea was to draw the Mercedes Benz emblem. He put it on humpers. I like it already. <laughs> it sounds like a good idea. Look, these cards, too. These would be great for the teacher, babe. Look at this. See, cause I'll use all of these little strips of stuff, right? See how much stuff you can do with this paper, though? Louise Cassia says this gave her a great idea. Nice. And she thinks she's gonna do her Christmas cards like this and send them out like that. Oh, nice, nice. Look. 
I think you need to do that. Just go ahead and do it. If it's in your mind and in your heart, oh to do no, it, Kathy, then go ahead and do it. Kathy, come with one of those candy bars. No, these these candy bars are not getting in there. Okay, let's see how much how it would fit though. I'm gonna take it back exactly. out. Exactly. <laughs> That's long enough. Look, there fits. you go. Bring it back. <laughs> Put a nice candy bar in there for the teacher. Now, if you put that in there, the teacher will know you're blackmailing them. Uh, <laughs> I mean, you're bribing them. <laughs> oh. I can't do physics. If you study, you could do some physics. <laughs> Johnny's failing my class, but... He gave me that really cute book. No, no, don't, we're not gonna do that. I can't do man. <laughs> that cute envelope I'm book. Not if you never study. <laughs> They'll stop. I've seen people say that oh, I can't do math, and they would never study. They just want to be able to look at the page, and somehow the math reveals itself to them. You know, and it just doesn't work like that. Mm. Look, y'all can stick these in here too. Um, pass me some, like, a uh, some packaging from there, babe. Just pass me some of that packaging right here. Right. And this, this, right, this is good right here. Okay. Let's see. So this, let's see, this is some, I need something sturdy for this. I'm going to throw one of these in there, too. Y'all got teacher friends, right? So what we're going to do, I'm just giving this a back because I pulled this apart. I want it to lay flat. I didn't want it to be so thick. So I'm going to take one of these now. I'm sticking it in one of those pockets. But it needs uh, some kind of little backing on there. Marjorie, so I'm going to put this backing right here across there. Oh, and we're going to just stick that right in there. Hey, Tracy. Yeah. Mar Marjorie says her husband keeps bugging her on, ma on Messenger. She obviously had heard Johnny Taylor. But Johnny Taylor says, when he stops asking where you been, it's time to bring it on in. Be happy he called. He'd be, Baby, where you at on Messenger? You know what I mean? <laughs> okay. Then, hey, a couple months from now, my husband ain't saying nothing to me on Messenger. What's going on? <laughs> <sighs> y'all look at me. Look at me looking. I need to, I need to stop, don't I, y'all? One more thing, as Bill would say in you my know, Bill that voice. One more thing gets you in trouble. Just one more one thing. More Let me see what y'all are saying. Mary Brock says a little stamp pad and, and gel, gel stamp, stamp to grade, to grade her, her paper. paper. She's or, to her. or guess what, y'all? Guess what? What? What about? Would that fit in there? What about? You gotta make that get in. <laughs> Look, I'm taking the stickers out. <laughs> get out. <laughs> Put a mindless <clears throat> stamp, teacher stamp kit together for the teacher. Doesn't quite fit, but, but if you, you, but if you, you if take you, it out uh, that packaging, huh? At the beginning, if you space it out right, it'll fit. Though. Yes, it will. It will. You just, have to know up front. Just a thought, y'all. You just have to know up front that that's what you're going to do. You can cut like a little sliver off to get that packaging in there. Yep. Well, make the envelope longer, you'd actually end up making that part wider when you cut it, the paper. So that way it fits, it covers it up. Look, I'm determined, y'all. <laughs> Put one of these in there. Mayor Brock says, now you're thinking. Put one of those in there. Or you could just put it up, place it on top gently. Won't close, but still. Anyway. Or here, here's what you do. You take this. Oh, we have to be wider. Put that. Look. <laughs> you got to make that thing get on there, aren't you? I'm making sure that that teacher gets our stamp set. <clears throat> Oops. Well, that's one way to I got to go back and do that. But, yeah, just kind of be gentle, though, y'all. I got so excited and taught my little book here. Tore up my book. Tore the book up. I'm trying to make it work. Bill, we're going to a barbecue to, today. We're going to a barbecue with one of Bill's friends from school. Even though we have a diet, but we'll have a favorite saying I always use. After that. We're eating healthier, darling. Nadine Harrison, but Tracy, you didn't do any stitching. Nadine, look at you now. Nadine B says. Nadine, this is what happens when you let a whole bunch of people in your craft room. 
She has company. <laughs> maybe, maybe B has company, Tracy. Okay. Her vacuum is sitting next to her while she's doing 10 other things. And you have company coming. No, her vacuum is the company. Oh. <laughs> I actually need to vacuum too. But I'd rather be crafting. She just had to stitch. Y'all just had to have her stitch. Y'all reminded me. Oh, Azrael Horsfeld said, oh, that would be so cute to send it to a crafty friend who hasn't built up a stamp set collection. Oh. Get them started off, kind of. Yeah. Once you start, it kind of gets to be kind of cool. It's really fun. Seriously. If y'all haven't tried this, just go ahead and have fun with it. Tracy Don't go had, for perfection. Uh, a group of women over at the house, they were all crafting. And one woman, one of the women, was, she was kind of resistant to it at first. Ah, uh, well, I'm not really that good. She, at first, she started out kind of lack lusterly. Please. We had to almost pry her away from the table. Yes, I showed her. She them. was so focused in it as the, as the crafting Right. She's like, on. when are we going to, when can we come over and make cards? <laughs> Show us how to make cards. You know what? That stitching does look kind of good on there. Yeah. You know, it kind of adds a completeness to it. It just adds another thing of interest. Like, it just kind of makes everything kind of tie together. It looks fun with this. Hi, oh, here's Leslie. The, in case y'all didn't see, here's the other one that I did. Um, Using our newest stamp set. Life is sweet. So that's just the other one that, that I did. So you can do just about anything with this one. Robert Renner just says, don't forget to sign it. Thank you, Robert. Marjorie says, it's so cute. Glad my electricity came back on. She's electrified again. <laughs> <clears throat> Y'all charged up. Look, if you're in a creative slump, get some of your papers out and start doing this. Just start placing the papers, then go to for the stickers, then, you know. Now, I feel like if I did stitching on this side, this is just me. I feel like I need to do stitching on this side. <laughs> but look how fun that looks. Susan Stewart says, technically, now, if you really wanted to make that uh, stamp set fit, you could pull out the, the cardboard on the inside. Yeah, that's what down, I'm saying. Yep. Uh, yeah. Yep, trim it down. The paper, too. Seriously. Then glue, glue right. the plastic. Trim that part down. Yeah. Leave this part on here. <laughs> Don't glue this part down because they really oh, want yeah. that. You know that. Uh -oh. Plastic is material consisting of plastic. I didn't ask you nothing about no plastic. <laughs> Bill's phone. You know what? I think the electronics is listening to us. They're listening to us. We were sitting the other day and all of a sudden. Uh, Alexa. Alexa. Oh. My dog, when he hears Alexa, he, he, does he not freaks like out. Alexa. He starts running. He's sleeping under the, under the table right now, but he does not like to hear. He's scared to death of Alexa. He sure, especially when she starts talking back to us. And he's kind of scared. He of does Google. not like that echo. When you say "Hey Google," all of a sudden the dog just freaks out. <laughs> ah, y'all look too much. I'm so glad y'all joined us today. Oh yes, Donna. Oh well, actually she said, "Margie, did you get the happy mail I sent to you?" But Donna, we got yours too. Yes, we sure did, Donna. We we actually um we still been going to the mailbox and guess what? Y'all still send <laughs> sending. Right. We're still receiving Mike on the bike Christmas card. We are still receiving though it's ended in August. The end of August it ended, but y'all are still it's still trickling in. I'm still going to send them on to him, uh, whatever comes in. You're right, Mar Marlene says the stitching really makes it. It really does. I'm not gonna it does put an added dimension. I'm getting me a t-shirt. I'm going to get one that says stitching in the kitchen. Kitchen. <laughs> in the who? <laughs> Diane Solomon says she got a friend in the car making. Her husband told her that I created a monster. Mm. That's how it started. That's what Mika's mom. I know. Mika's she started mom. off kind of reluctant a little yeah, bit. Yeah, Mika's mom, my sister-in-law, her mom... Um, she said her mom, we created a monster because her mom was over here and we created these little, the little mini books. I showed them how to make these, y'all. The mini books that you make out of the um, eight and a half by 11 paper. No, this is, these were made with the 12 by 12 paper. 
they absolutely enjoyed it. Okay. Enjoyed it. it. <laughs> enjoyed it. it. That's what you really enjoyed, okay? I enjoyed it, that. Oh, my goodness. Did you enjoy it, it baby? I enjoyed it, it. <laughs> She enjoyed it, okay? That's when you start baby talking to yourself, okay? Oh, Miriam Splash's paint. Where have you been? Miriam Splash's paint. What's going on? We've been waiting. We couldn't even get off until you got here, How okay? How on earth is she going to just come in live talking about... Hi, Tracy and Bill. Hey. How are you? Just kind of slide in there with the little wavy hair. They won't notice that I ain't been here. <laughs> y'all didn't notice that Miriam Splash's paint wasn't in there until we called her out, did y'all? <laughs> uh, that stitching really takes it to another level. Yep. Kathleen German says, we got a new vacuum today. And my boyfriend already used it. There you go. Well, we have a vacuum too. <laughs> it is it's so good for hanging clothes and stuff on. <sighs> Diane said, I think the art winter glue is getting to my brain. <laughs> I'm over here singing songs. I'm messing up words. Hold up, you know what though? Seriously, getting back to this uh uh what's that thing called out there, Tracy? That the dog scared of? Alexa, babe. The echo. Hold it's up. The echo. I promise you, I can't remember exactly what it said, but Tracy said something to it, and and she was nasty. To she, me. she said, "I said, didn't I say such and such something?" We were like, "What? <laughs> Who is Alexa? Think she's talking to?" I was ready to throw Alexa out the house. No, what I did was I <laughs> I asked her. I, I said, said that, didn't I? Right, because I said, "Alexa, are you listening to us?" And then she said so. She paused for a she moment. Said like so she said something smart. Thinking. And she said something about um, talk to somebody, Amazon or something. You can love. If you don't like it, then you call Amazon <laughs> and see what they got. To some, some she said. I was like, Bill Lexa didn't say all yes, that. Yes, she did. Too. I promise y'all, she said it. I don't know what Bill talking about. He, look at this. This yeah, band is coming You give yourself. You may have to get leave the house. I'm gonna pick up a couple of these at Dollar Tree because they have them in different colors. What is they make me get a couple of so these. smart that? You almost feel like you're talking to a person now. No, I Lex ain't a person, okay? She was kind of rude that she was kind of rude that day. She sure was. I'll have to ch make my bow look a little bit better than this, y'all. Oh, it's upside down. No wonder. <laughs> talking about Alexa. Hi, Liz Fletcher. She just got here. Liz Fletcher, you'll have to go back and watch the rewatch. Oh, oh, oh Brian Marquise said, "Did you did, did her package go in the mail today?" Which package? Her order. Oh, yes, yes, yes. We are on it. Okay, Ron. We are <laughs> on it. See, look. Look, Diane Solomon. She says her echo woke up in the middle of the night talking to her. I thought someone got in the house. I'd have beat it to death. <laughs> What's the <laughs> What in the uh, world? Some black tool would be nice on here. Phil, look on my card. See that black tool right there? What? See that right there? What? See that black tool? Let me, I want to see what it looks like. Right, right there. The, the, oh, the, this. That stuff. Okay. Like the, the thousand. Black tool? What black tool? <laughs> I'm going to give you this. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Anything black, huh? But you know what? What she said, give me the black tool. I, I, I reached for all the all this stuff right here. <laughs> tool. P-U-L-L-E. Tool. <laughs> This would be cute, I think. I think just to add a little bit more interest, just a little bit more interest, something like that would be cute. But what do you think? I mean, for if it's a female teacher, you know. But since this is for a female teacher, I am going to just cut that down a little bit. And just wrap that around. I think that'll be just so cute. Smart dogs. She promised Donna Sally promised her dogs that she would take them to the dog park today. And now her dog is anxious to go. They know oh, what you're saying. They're like, get off of that live with Tracy and Bill. Dogs can spell. 
Mom, get off that. <laughs> yeah, because we can't say that W-A-L-K word either. He just started hopping around like every, like. Yeah, don't. I can say. spell. That's kind of cute. Okay. okay, I see where you're going. Oh, I was kidding just because I ordered this AM, but y'all are not. You're all on it as usual. Oh, yeah. Look, Ron, by now you should have gotten your confirmation saying that sure. your package is in the mail. So, yeah. If you ordered this AM, it went out to the uh, post office this morning. So I hope y'all love this. I hope y'all are inspired. Just get your stuff and just do it. You know, don't think about it. Now, if you want to do some tags, this is the last thing. Just one more thing, y'all. You can do some tags or put these little journal cards in there. Oh, you finna get on another um, level now. You can. You see this right here? If you wanted to, you can cut this out. Here's some built-in stitching. Right. Look at that built-in stitching right there. <laughs> There's so much you can do. Now the Sally says, I think this project turned out great. Thank you. So all these little cards can go into inserts as well. And the teacher can add it to... Oh! Uh oh, Bill, you need to found something else. Get, look, pass me the half notebook right there, baby. Where? Right down there in the corner. In the bottom, bottom shelf in the corner there. Pass me that. Y'all, if you still have these half notebooks, right? Right? Now you're starting to make matching gifts for the teacher, right? So, uh-oh. I'm hoping that... Are y'all still there? Wait no, a minute. I'm 104 minutes. They have, right, they don't have no picture. Uh-oh. I still, still see your comments, too. Hmm. Let's see. It's been on a long time. Still have the chat. I lost the video, but you still have the chat. Okay, now you're back on. You're back on. Oh. Now we're back on. Look over this way, Trace, while I work on the TV. Oh, okay. No, that's yeah. all right. I, I can look on my phone. It's back again. Okay, good. <laughs> Woo. Almost lost, y'all. Okay, I'm just cutting some of these up, Bill. I was just showing them what they could possibly do with this, with this little book. Maybe we'll come back and do another one, um, another live, and, and show them how to decorate a couple of these books. I think that'll be fun. Bill, did you see? Did I see what? <laughs> I don't know. They got an arrow going up. Miriam splashes paint. Oh, Miriam splashes paint. Let me find Miriam. How do you make those arrows? I love those. those arrows. I've been looking for those arrows. Maybe it's under the happy face. Bill, did face. you see? I don't know how she makes those hair. <laughs> That's what I need emoji. So many there. books, so little time. So many crafts, so little time. Look at that fat pencil. That's cute. So much you can do okay, with this. Mirror slices paint. Let me find you. Amadeus Labit says, I love this project. I don't have any children in school anymore. That's the project you really love. But my oldest granddaughter lives in Austin. I may have to make a few and get my son to take them to get to the teachers. Oh, yes. Yes. I think these would be a hit with the teacher. I'm looking for mirror splashes paint. Said something. Might have lost the comment. Other than the YouTube didn't notify her. They fired all of them. Let's see. Uh... <laughs> Great work. Never judge a book by its cover. A oh, random act of crafting says something. Susan Stewart. Somebody says something. Hold on. Let me see. Let me just keep going. Let me go back up. Like that little thing right there. Y'all just watching me cut up this stuff. I don't know if you get in your craft room, you just start cutting stuff. Next thing you know, it's three hours later. I can't find it, y'all. Whatever is up above, you have to repeat it. 
Sewer, sewer's making all kind of symbols. I don't know how she did it. <laughs> oh, it's not here? Is that See where it is? Emoji thing? Oh, you didn't know about that? No. Yeah, what? click on that. Yeah, oh, you just find something. Huh? Yeah. Find all kinds of stuff. Okay. Oh, yeah, I see him. Look at yeah. that, all that stuff. Oh, I keep to ask me, babe. <laughs> <sighs> oh, thank you. Ken Ken said I enjoy your videos. Thank you, Ken Ken. <laughs> Liz, Liz Fletcher says she tries to stay out of the shops, but everyone has online sales. That is so true. And don't be an Amazon Prime member because that's just, oof. They have a new thing with Amazon just now. so much stuff. Ugh. When they have a special something, they say, can we email you? No. Or by phone. Or mm. No, thank you. As much stuff as they got, you be getting texts around the clock. Mm. I'm wondering how you know that, darling. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So I didn't sign up because I don't want my phone to lose. This book would be precious, decorated like this. Oh my goodness. So what are you doing? I'm just um look. <laughs> I'm just chatting with my crafty friends. See now these you can stick in the teacher's book as well. All of this, these little cards. These can these actually can you can turn these into cards for the teacher as well. You can make a matching card for the teacher. Okay, where's my scraps of paper? Let's no, make no. a let's make a quick card for the teacher. If y'all have a little bit of time. I know some of y'all may have to go, but I'm gonna make a really quick card for those of you that the have teacher. more than 113 minutes on a Saturday. What we learn becomes who we are. That's cute. Great work. I'm crushing this school thing. Love it. That's cute, too. Loving that pencil. Okay, so let's make a nice little card for my teacher. Diane says, how's the testing of... The Halloween stamps coming mm. out. Diane? <laughs> Diane, stop now. Okay, now I'm gonna bring out my paper trimmer because I, I want I'm gonna make this work pretty uh. fast. Diane is not Diane. Work with us, Diane. Work with us. <laughs> I am trying to start stuff. Diane. So all those scraps that y'all have now. Oh, Mary Swash's paint didn't get the notification. That's oh. what happened. How dare they, Diane? Mary Brock says Tracy won't answer about Halloween. Mm. Liz is like a kid with a in the candy store. She's discovered these uh her and Amethyst discovered these arrows and they are just <laughs> oh, bananas with look it. at y'all trying to get us to look at comments. It's not even there. Susan Stewart just did it with one of the circles of hers. <laughs> look at this, y'all. Look at this just absolute cuteness. Marlene Watts says, I'm retired, so I can do what I need to do anytime I want to do it. There you so go. Keep on going. Oh, well, there you go. I'm cutting this out right here. Mimi B says, What about a Thanksgiving stamp? I'm not saying anything to y'all. <laughs> Bye, Bye, Donna. Donna Sally has to go, Grace. All right, Donna. Bye. For those of you that wanted me to use um, humpers. Thank you so much. AKA mounting tape in this video. Bill, my desk is kind of looking like when you cry. Mm, see, it's not just me. <laughs> Let's go ahead and use this. We are going to go ahead and I got to get more of this. We should have looked for this while we were at Dollar Tree earlier. We need more of these. You can never have enough of these, really. Um, I mean, Tracy Ron says you're a stamp tease. 
<laughs> Sorry. Look what Mary Brock said up there. <laughs> Y'all are funny. Mary, you're giving us hints, aren't you? If you buffer, you know the drill, the fresh. Find some background paper there. Y'all don't want to cut into your papers. I know y'all. <laughs> um, Bill, can I see some black paper right there? Please. Yeah, those are your leftovers from the other night, I believe. Let's see what we got here. If we could fit this on a card. I'm trying to use some of Bill's leftovers from the other night. Plus, we can make a little card for the teacher. Elvis Labique says that they found a huge roll of mountain tape at Dollarama for $1.25. Mm. And you snapped that thing up, didn't you? You sure did. I hope you did. Do I really want to reach over to this cart? And get my um trimmer, my paper trimmer. Not really. Where's it? Oh yeah, I get it. No, I got it, Ben. Look. Oh yeah, you, I did the <laughs> eyeball thing. Yeah. Do I really want to do that, right? She's doing the eyeball thing, everybody. Yep, just eyeball it. Now I'm cutting into another piece of paper, y'all. Y'all don't like this. I'm cutting into another piece of paper. All I don't right, know if Kathy, are Kathy like has to run to her husband needs her to double check the list so she can send him back out somewhere else and give him some more free time. <laughs> yeah. I love you. Let me give you some more Ooh, free this time. paper's so cute. Oh my goodness. Look at the little backpacks on this. J.D. Harris says, so all of those not getting notification, she had to reset her notification this morning because she stopped getting them. She clicked on a little bell and she... It had gone to none on its own, so she reset it to all. Mm. So do that. Go to your notification bells, everybody, and make sure that they're on all. If it works, wow. we can thank Nadine Harris. Thanks, Nadine. Thanks, Nadine. Look at y'all technologically advanced people. Nadine is technical, okay? Y'all just in here killing oh, it. Oh, Mary Slash's Paint says, did your Dollar Tree have Christmas items in yet? Oh, you didn't see us at Dollar Tree this morning. Yes, it does. We went live this morning. And then about 45 minutes later, we, we came on for this one. Yeah. But they only have one little section. They're waiting until the Halloween stuff is gone. That one little section had quite a bit of things. If you didn't see that video, the live that we did this morning, you got to go and see it. But she, what she said was... What they're going to do is when Halloween is over, slide it down. Slide things over. Mm -hmm. And then they'll slide over the Thanksgiving and make it a little bit more deeper. But then they'll make Oops. Christmas have about three or four rolls instead of just one side. Yeah, they have a system in place. They got a system getting all that stuff together. Don't do this, y'all. Try to stitch before you even get the um. <laughs> Give me a card for the teacher. Bill, my white gel pen is starting to run low. Hmm. This is another thing I have to have. Normally I would do this when it's flat add the stitching before I add it on here. But I just thought stitching about it. looks good on the teacher thing. Thanks, babe. Seriously, it does. You can cut your paper apart. Do whatever you want with it. Now, I'm going to cut out one of these book bags because I think it looks super cute. Shannon Avery says she's making this for her planner as soon as she gets home. Oh, nice. Good idea. You see this green bag right here? I'm going to fussy cut that. Some of you teachers, you could have your kids make some of these to teach them the, the value of, of having. So they have their own just tailored journals. 
Oh. And write in them every day or something. That's a good idea. If they like, maybe at some point during the term, they can, you can have a day where they share some of their thoughts that they want to share. Mm-hmm. Things about, yeah, nice writing, writing ex ex exercise. Exercise. We don't want to share that one, though, okay? Tell them, just don't writing. share the exercise. <laughs> We're writing make, exercise. We have to come back next year to the same <laughs> grade, okay? <sighs> yeah, Nadine says, I was just thinking that Tracy was fusty cutting. Fusty? <laughs> Nadine, you've been hanging around our channel a little too long. Because we're rubbing off, okay? Y'all are too funny. Okay, so I'm adding the green in there because where's my cute, that cute green polka dot paper is just so pretty. That's not it. Oh, here it is. The green polka dot paper. Marlene Watts says, move your tongue off your eye tube so you can see what you're saying. <laughs> that might help. Oh, y'all are funny. Let's do this layout. That was a good one, Marlene. That was kind of like a tongue twist. I had to think about that one. Let's do a, a layout. <laughs> Do this layout right here because we could do anything we want can't we i used to love little strange sayings like that when i was a kid mm. you know something like i saw guys so tall he had to sit just to stand like what <laughs> <laughs> huh and then the mind is like thinking. <laughs> you're thinking about it had to sit just to stand what kind of guy is I saw a guy so tall he had to sit down just to comb his hair. <laughs> I think I'm getting that one. I'm, the wheels are still turned in that one. Okay. I'm like, huh? <laughs> I think we've been on this live long enough. Bill is ready to go, seriously, as you can hear. From his uh, his joking around, I'm just making a matching card for the teacher. I don't know what I'm doing, but I'm just playing it by ear. Playing it by ear. Meeting here says, "What happened with uh, I think book or journal? Right here, see, it's a picture." Huh? What happened with the book? You make is that what you're doing now? Um, this is the book right here. Oh. What do you mean? What happened with? I'm not sure. <laughs> no, I don't understand. I'm, I'm I'm doing a card right now. Miriam splashes paint. She gave you a hundred for Aww. your grade for mindless crafting. Thank you. Shanta Cohen says, I know I'm late. Hi, Shanta. But where did you get the paper, please? The paper is actually in our store. Here's the link. No, that ain't the link. Look, you better get there before everybody else <laughs> grabs it. Up. I'll find the link. Y'all are in that store buying stuff. This is a very popular paper. I've had to, this is, I had to order this actually twice um, to put back in the store. Okay, so let's go ahead and add this in. I'm just making a quick card for the teacher, basically. This is, how, this is another way to use your papers, too, so. This is so fun to do, y'all. So much fun. That's cute too, but I think it needs a little bit of black around the edges. Y'all know I love to put black around that edge there just to bring it out. All right, here is where you'll find that paper pack. Okay. Yeah, this is the back to school paper pack. 
And I'm just using my little scraps here and some of the things that Bill left over from when he was mindlessly crafting the other day. Bill, everyone loved the card that you did the other day, too. Oh, well, thank you. I could have kept going. I, I, I actually stopped because I said, you know, I'm going so long. Let me just stop. So we're going to do something like that, right? Okay. Let's go ahead and do this, y'all. Look at this. This is all I have of this roll. I think I have more somewhere around here. I'm sure I do. Just got to clean up my room and find it. Oh, that's a notebook. That's what she says. What happened with the notebook? That's what she was saying. Oh, this right here. Well, you're not going to do that notebook. No, 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 no. We're not doing this. I was just showing them. When I looked at this, I was like, ooh. But if you wanted to, you could really decorate the notebook. You could put this on, you know, something like this. Real quick and easy things to decorate the book. But I was thinking maybe to do something with the notebook on another live Louis, in the future. Louis Cassius says, Castillo says, going to watch every craft video you make because I learned so much. Wow. You're a good role model and a good teacher. Thank you Thank so you much. Thank you so much. Me. Have fun watching those seven. Are we going over 700 videos now? Yes. Yeah, I think there's like 700 videos yeah, on the 700. channel. Yeah. Plus. <laughs> Okay, Bill, I need more of the, um, let's see if I can find some more of this. That's all. Some more of this. We need some this. <laughs> let's see. Oh, here. Yeah, we always have enough of this. You can never have enough of the mounting tape. Oh, yeah. You yeah. used a, a bunch of it the other night, too, so. You always lose stuff when you clean your room. How about cleaning your room and then you find stuff and you get so caught up doing that that you forget to, that you forget that you're cleaning. Uh, what about that? that. <laughs> okay. What about that? Ron Marquis says she's pretty sure she's seen all seven hundred plus of them. Really, Ron? My I goodness, mean, Ron. Y'all be watching. I thought Margie was the one. Margie she, can watch. Margie, okay? whoa, Margie, Margie can teach a class. Margie, I think Margie can teach a class too. <laughs> she was <laughs> ah, she's supposed to be focusing on on what she's doing she read that <laughs> I'm reading y'all comments and cracking up here y'all Bill can you pass me the pokey tool thing with the with the blue handle the blue and white handle that light blue right, so I, I've got it so okay All right, Bill's leaving the room. So let's go ahead and add this in. We're almost done, y'all. I promise we're done. I think y'all have had enough of us for the day, <laughs> for one day. But this was really fun. And I'll show y'all this one more time for those of you who are just coming in to the live. Mary, you want us to stay on, really? <laughs> you said stay on. Yeah, I'm just adding some glue on here, y'all. That's a quick teacher card. Nice and neat. Look how cute that looks. And I'm just putting stitching using a Sharpie, y'all. I'm breaking the rules, but there are no rules in crafting.
Hmm. Let's see. Chelsea didn't get her album yet. And the reason why is because we're going to be going up there to see Chelsea. So I will be able to give it to her um, personally. Yep. Oh, thank you so much. I'm so glad that you can spend time in the craft room with us. And I'm glad you're enjoying it too. I know, isn't that nice? We're pretty excited. So I think sometime in October, we're supposed to be going up there. I'm glad y'all like this card. Let me finish this off. Uh, just quickly. Yep, Bill and I are going to be spending the weekend with Chelsea. Yep, we sure are. Nadine, we're coming to, <laughs> we're going to be in D.C. Somewhere. Gotta come see my baby. I'm going to look these stickers, y'all. Oh, my goodness. You know I got to put something on here, right? Oh, thank you, Shanta. I'm so glad you, you love this um, creation. So I'm going to put this right here. Little bookshelf right there for the teacher. <laughs> We've been on for over two hours, I know. Yes, we have. Okay, so we got this. Let's see what else we got. I think I'm gonna put some glasses in here, over in this corner right here. And so now you have a matching card for your teacher. I'm gonna write a little message in here. And this is just so adorable, y'all. I'm just like, and I think this takes it to another level too, putting the, I'm gonna leave this on here. I'm gonna take this off right here. And you can do, like I said, you can do this for a bus driver as well. So, you know, there's so much to work with, with this. Here's what it looks like. Here's what it looks like. And you got this three envelopes now. You got a matching card for the teacher. So there's so much you can do. We know, Deborah. We see him. Don't worry about it. <laughs> oh, don't worry about it. It's okay, y'all. Thank you so much, Nadine. Thank you. I appreciate it. You're going to make one, make one, please. Y'all go ahead and make this. Here's what the back part looks like before we go. Giving y'all another last look at this. This was absolutely fun. I'm glad y'all were patient with me while I got this done. I had a good time making this. And you can do this, just change the entire theme. Make one for Christmas. I mean, imagine next year for like Valentine's Day, someone's birthday. I mean, there's so much you can do. I'm in love with this. And I hope you are too. Um, go ahead and head over to our store if you want to get this paper pack. It's the, let me get this paper. Let me show them what this looks like. It's the back to school paper pack that's what the cover looks like and it's it's in our store <laughs> oh this will be a fun halloween one too marlene is saying
Ron Marcus, so nice with your two stamp sets. Yes, this goes really well with the stamp sets. I'm pretty happy about that. Look at that. And if you want, you can get your teacher a stamp set so that she can stamp out some stuff. That's the um, teacher appreciation. Let me show you. Let's see if I have, do I have a back to school one. In here? Oh, y'all, here's the back to school one. Look at that. That's the back to school stamp. So it'd be great to use it along with this paper. So guess what? We're going to go ahead and sign off because Bill and I have to go to a barbecue today. And they said that we need to bring a dessert. So we got to go and get dessert and get ready in whichever order. So we'll see you soon. Oh, Bill. Oh, Bill said that he no, doesn't he want to sign off. Yeah, oh, okay. Something. Yeah, so we're getting ready to go ahead and, and sign off. Um, actually, Smile is a new color. We actually have two stamp sets in our store, two Christmas stamp sets. So I'm just reading your comments. Bye, Liz. Take care. Ron, you're so welcome. We were so glad to do this with y'all. Yeah, go to our mindlesscrafting.com uh, store and you can go ahead and. Oh, Louis Castle. You can go ahead it. and do it. You can go ahead and buy it there. I started watching you guys when I saw Bill, that's me, make a card. <laughs> and I fell in love with it, but I just can't remember the name of which card it was. But that's when I started becoming a fan. Oh, nice. Oh, Robin, we love you too. We love all of y'all. Now we can go. So we'll take y'all take care and we're gonna go enjoy some time out with friends. So see y'all soon. And we'll see you on the next live. Bye.